Hello friends, this is Jagdish Park Associate. Today I am going to explain a solved problem from the chapter first law of thermodynamics. First I will read the question. The question is 1.5 kg of liquid having a constant specific heat of 2.5 kJ per kg degree Celsius is stirred in a well insulated chamber causing the temperature to raise, rise by 15 degree Celsius. Find change in internal energy and work done for the process. Now I will analyze the question. There is a chamber and the chamber is well insulated which means there will be no heat transfer from the chamber to the surroundings or surroundings to the chamber. The chamber is filled with liquid and the mass of the liquid is 1.5 kg and the specific heat of the liquid is 2.5 kJ per kg degree Celsius. The liquid is well stirred inside the chamber. Thereby, the temperature of the liquid will be increased by 15 degrees Celsius. So, in this question, we have to find the values of change in internal energy and work done. First, we will find the value of change in internal energy. The change in internal energy is taken as du. And the formula is du is equal to mcv dt, where m is mass of the liquid, cv is specific heat of the liquid, and dt is temperature difference or increase in temperature. So mass of the liquid is 1.5 kg and specific heat of the liquid is 2.5 kJ per kg degree Celsius and rise in temperature is 15 degree Celsius. Therefore du is equal to 1.5 kg into 2.5 kJ per kg degree Celsius into 15 degree Celsius. So in this RHS I am going to split the numerical terms and SI units separately. So du is equal to 1.5 into 2.5 into 15 into kg into kJ per kg degree Celsius into degree Celsius. 1.5 into 2.5 into 15 is 56.25. So du is equal to 56.25 into kg into kJ into degree Celsius divided by kg into degree Celsius. So in this RHS, kg kg gets cancelled and degree Celsius and degree Celsius gets cancelled. Therefore, du is equal to 56.25 kilojoules. Consider this one as equation 1. Now we will find the value of work done, which is dw. We know that the chamber is well insulated, which means there will be no heat transfer from the chamber to the surroundings or surroundings to the chamber. Thereby, the process carried out inside the chamber will be an adiabatic process. So, for finding the value of work done, we have to use the formula of work done during adiabatic process. And the formula is dW is equal to U1 minus U2. And consider this equation as equation 2. Since du is equal to U2 minus U1. So, in this RHS, take negative sign as common. So, du will be equal to minus of u1 minus u2. Now, bring this negative sign to the LHS. Thereby, u1 minus u2 will be equal to minus du. Consider this one as equation 3. Now, substitute equation 3 in equation 2. By substituting equation 3 in equation 2, this u1 minus u2 will be replaced by minus du. Therefore, dw is equal to minus du. Consider this one as equation 4. Now substitute equation 1 in equation 4. By substituting equation 1 in equation 4, this du will be replaced by 56.25 kilojoules because 56.25 kilojoules is the value of change in internal energy. So we are substituting the change in internal energy value in equation 4. Thereby dw is equal to minus 56.25 kilojoules. Consider this one as equation 5. Now we will look into the conclusion. Equation 1 is change in internal energy value that is du is equal to 56.25 kJ and equation 5 is work done value and the value is dw is equal to minus 56.25 kJ and these two values are the answer for this question. So friends this is the way to solve this problem. I hope you all would have understood. If any doubts are there please do comment in comment box. And remember to like, share and comment on our videos. And please do subscribe our channel, The Mechanical Engineers Theme.
and don't forget to click the bell icon so that you will get the notifications for new videos thank you friends